So I'm going to try to move two of my plants that were in the hydro bucket over to these Walmart cracky containers. This is a um, Black Vitale and this is a um, Chocolate Primo Reaper and this may be screwed up. It's been like this for a couple of days and hasn't died yet but it's kind of broken a little bit there. But um, I'm going to try to put some tape around it to give it a little more support and then I'll have more support when it goes in here. So, um, this is just like the um, 32 gallon setup as far as the uh, net pot goes. This is a 6 inch net pot and you can see the um, underneath how I, I did that. Um, if you want to see how I made it just look at my 32 gallon cracky setup. I'll put a link in the, um, in the description there. Um, one thing too is if you'll notice when the um, when it's full the sides kind of bow out a little bit so if you um, I mean you can snap it in there but then they'll pop out again so you just have to use a couple zip ties one on each side I've got a couple on the ends too just to be safe but really probably just need one on each side just to hold, hold it in and uh, so when it's snapped in that's how much water I've got I'm going to wrap the roots down on the bottom and then pack in some cocoa um, core material around it. And I was able to get right at 13 gallons in here, just a FYI, and I already pre-mixed my nutrients. And that's also, if you look at the 32 gallon cracky container, you can see how I did the nutrients and mixed them in. I uh, also have another video on how I measure out my, my uh, master blend materials. Uh, so uh, anyway, uh, let me get the um, plants set up and we'll move them over here. Carefully try to pull this guy out. Yeah, this is why you don't leave these in here as long as I did. It's crazy. I think this guy's probably going to break off, but I'm going to try. Just barely a connection there. that answers that so, so I'll work on the trying to save the fatality there. I set up two of these containers I'm, I've got some plants and cups over here I'll stick one of them in it you know I'm trying to free this fatality black fatality see so yeah, I don't leave these in these tiny little setups for too long especially more than one kind of a disaster like I've got here pretty good little root mass there pick these dead leaves out okay so ready to go ahead and pack this guy in here probably need a bigger maybe like the 8 inch snip pot um, what I'm hoping is this will grow new roots from the bottom of this down into the solution. Barely deep enough. I still need to secure this too. Um, once the roots start going through the bottom, they'll kind of anchor it a little more too. There should be a fill and forget setup, so I'm hoping there'll be enough solution. The rest of the season shouldn't have to do anything to it. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put my zip ties on. Okay, so here's the everything done, cleaned up, and the zip ties. I want to give Matt Garver credit for discovering that cheap solution 
So ways you can use these five dollar Walmart totes, and uh, works. It should work really well. I did notice at Walmart they had two black totes, and this one was like fifty cent more than the other one. They looked identical, but I did notice the the uh, material looked a little thicker, so it's probably better for black and light, maybe a little sturdier. So I went ahead and got this one. And this is an orange brain strain I just did. It's the CPR broke. I um, I took one. I've got a couple that are in cups over here. Or if you get it, so I took one, washed it off really well. The roots put it in here, so um, should do okay. Okay, it's been about two weeks since I set this tote up, and I just want to show how it's doing before I post this. It's kind of merging with my carbon air, but I got a lot of new growth on it. This is the Black Vitale, so it's it's looking really good. And by the way, the carbon air is looking better than it ever has since I put it in the larger tote. It's got a lot of pods all over it too. And this is the orange brain strain that was in the cup. It's, in, it's looking really good because it was about this size and now it's this size. So I really need to get those others into something so they can start growing better. But yeah, he looks great. And um, if you uh, like this, uh, please subscribe to my channel and please comment if you want. And um, thank you for watching.